Welcome guys to a brand new video on solo leveling arise. So in today's video, I want to focus on a particular SR unit that I think is absolutely amazing in this game. And that is Nam Che Young. She's actually very, very good and one of the best SR units in the game. And uh, yeah, I have her maxed out in terms of her duping system. However, she's a really good SR unit that does not actually need dupes. But if you take a look at her dupes, uh essentially well the first dupe is very good because it increases her break effectiveness which is really really good because she is a breaker character and it comes in clutch especially when you're fighting against cerberus which i will be taking her into uh but the rest of it isn't too good so increasing explosive rage against bosses it's not like huge freeze duration is good so this one is actually really good so the freeze duration is increased to a, a, a three seconds but honestly you don't need dupes there's a bunch of other like good sr units but genuinely need the dupe but with her you don't need it because all she has that is very very good is the ability to freeze which is insanely good any ability that is uh uh, what's it called crowd control ability or cc ability freeze stun generally in this game is extremely good because uh it stops the enemy from attacking you and the enemies sometimes do huge and insane amount of damage especially if you're going against bosses so this is actually very very useful so if you take a look at a kit um the first two ones she's a water code character or sorry i said code she's a water type character the thing is though there's not that many like there's not many ssr units that are actually water code the only water type ssr in this game is seal and i don't have her so i was actually forced to build this unit and i realized how good she is but seal is the only water type character that is good and when you're fighting against cerberus you do you do sometimes feel like you need um or oh, please tell me i have keys available no i need to showcase her um yeah, you need a water code because a water type character because they do actually do extra damage to that enemy. Okay, that sucks. We can't take her into um, Cerberus, uh, but we will take her to another um, another content instead since we can't take her in. But I have used her in here and she works extremely well. Cerberus is a very very tricky boss. In fact, out of all the boss in this game, like in terms of in core in core missions. Uh, any commissions and instance dungeon i don't care what anyone has to say cerberus is the hardest one so, um what's it called igris is easy because you just have to break him that's fine but with cerberus oh my days trust me it's tricky as f tricky as f especially when you don't have water type characters to allow you to deal extra damage this actually is very very tricky but uh yeah so let's take a look at our kit sorry uh before we progress uh so there we go Anyways, before we carry on with the video guys, don't forget to like and subscribe. Do go ahead and show your support to the channel by liking the video if you guys find this video helpful. Um, yeah, let's get to 60 likes in today's video and let's get right into it. So, the first two skills don't really matter. She is a really good support character though. So, taking a look at basic skill, she basically does medium break, which is good. However, this is important. She has the ability to freeze. She freezes with a basic skill, her first basic skill, and the duration is two seconds. And then next one, um, it's a heavy break ability, which is decent. But then her special skill, so her support skill, has the ability to freeze. Now, in general, the damage isn't great, honestly, but the, the freeze is really, really good. Uh, it comes in clutch. And then she also has a freeze with her QTE and a freeze with her ultimate. She has freeze literally everywhere except this uh, basic skill over here and her normal attack. Now her passive over here just increases damage dealt to frozen targets by 20%. But honestly, the way I use her, I use her as a support character and only use her when I need to spawn in my characters. So uh, you know what, I'm going to take her into here, but don't be surprised when I don't beat this. Uh, because elemental damage and whatnot. So usually to beat Igris, what I do is I actually use um, him instead. So two break characters plus uh, a healer. What I can do instead is... I don't know who to change out actually. I probably have to change him out, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But I'm going to use her instead. So obviously I have she's not as built as my other character. She scales off if I remember correctly. Let me let me check actually. I think she scales off HP, but I might be wrong. Let me let me see. 
Yeah, it's HP. Okay, good. So I'm gonna give her this gear over here that I have. Uh, this one will allow her to get power gauge uh, acquisition, which will allow her to ult. That's fine. Actually, no, no. This is her being a support character. It's not gonna help with the ult, and actually, we just want her to be able to, you know, use the support skill, which will come in very, very clutch. And that's all that matters with her because it's the freeze. So I'm gonna go with break. Okay, so break. Yep, perfect. Uh, for him, I'm gonna have to give him back. Actually, you know what? I I will give him this one. It doesn't really matter, but I will give her this one instead. It doesn't really help anyways, but let's go into this. I hope not to use my shadows, honestly, because actually it doesn't really matter. I don't intend to actually complete this one, but we will try it actually. You know what? We will attempt to complete it. So there we go. Okay, we use this. So first of all, we're going to summon this guy. Okay, and then we're going to use her. Oh, no, we use Okay. Look at the freeze. Perfect. So he's frozen. This is very good, especially when Igris just likes to flip in attack us. If you can't dodge properly, it's going to come in very clutch. And she's also a break character, guys. So that's actually very useful. Oops. Okay, we're going to go behind him. Uh, we hope to can summon her again. But anyways. Okay, we're going to break Igris pretty soon. There we go. Uh, we're not going to use her next because the freeze don't really matter now since he's already on the ground but um, hopefully the AI doesn't spawn her in right now we need to use her when Igris comes out the AI did the AI is stupid guys I should have just waited okay so unfortunately the AI already used her um, especially when she was down so it made no sense to use her but the AI could not figure that out okay okay that sucks we're gonna get shot at perfect get behind we're gonna use the heels okay come in clutch with that freeze 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 his ass oh no okay she wasn't able to freeze that time that sucks okay that sucks damn boy okay let's go so we're gonna break oh no way no way dog no way dog oh, okay we're gonna do this again the freeze is very important now you you don't, you don't only have to use her as a support character honestly like um in the hunter section where you only have to use hunter characters she's actually really good because she has a freeze everywhere literally qte freeze uh basic skill freeze support skill freeze it's really good so take a look at the freeze here as you can see perfect and especially if you can't dodge properly it comes in very clutch okay so we're gonna do this okay my boy chillax so okay there we go we broke it i'm gonna have to turn the ai off okay perfect so i'm gonna show you when it comes in clutch when you need that freeze so there we go i'm gonna take her into the hunter section only as well so you can see how really good she is um, now he's on the field we're gonna freeze his ass there we go as you can see very very helpful but of course you need to still dodge guys don't be like me okay there we go we're gonna use her next okay there we go so she, I do think you can actually use her to beat Igris since all you really need is to break him okay oh it's too late with the freeze actually no she did freeze him did you notice that she froze him okay bro come out here don't at me bro there we go so she actually did manage to freeze him which was very helpful guys uh summon our shadows actually we're gonna break his ass break there we go so i'm not gonna sp um, summon the chick right here uh, but I'll use her now. There you go. She's frozen. Perfect. We use the alt. We go in. Perfect. Perfect. So that freeze is very, very like helpful, guys. Trust me on that. Okay. Okay. That's not good. That is not good. Okay. There we go. 
I don't like the fact that when you're trying to break the character, it pushes them away. It's very annoying. Okay. There you go. Look at that. It helped us out. She froze his ass. Trust me, boys. It's really very helpful, guys. That freeze will come in very handy. And it's... Ooh, there we go. It's nearly like a 100% like certain like freeze, you know? Um, so, yeah. Really good. Okay, we're going to use this next. Freezes S. There you go. See, look. Oh, my days. It's very helpful, guys. Trust me. And, yeah, he does that. I knew it. There you go. Come for you, boy. I've been fighting Igris for a very long time. I know his moves, like, off by heart. Doesn't mean I can dodge everything, but trust me, it's, it's pretty good. I've gone in better. Okay, we're going to get the healer next. The only thing we're going to struggle with is, like, damage. Okay. Oh, that sucks. Freeze his ass. Can we freeze him? Yes, we froze him. See, look. It's very useful. Okay, we're not able to be ingress with this team right now because we need we run, we don't have damage. That is fine. So what we're going to do is take her into the places where it's only answers instead. So let's go ahead and see how good she is. Okay. So we'll go over to game mode. Go over to battlefield of time. Hunter section uh 21 i don't know if she's gonna be useful in here but okay so i'm gonna take off troy actually troy is really good in here um okay we'll just go with take off okay so we go with this obviously i don't know if i'm gonna be able to beat this because as you can see the power walk difference is huge i don't think i've even worked on an artifact guys yeah, this is not a good artifact for her. She's a support character. So the best one you would actually want to go with is this one, which increases your power gauge, um, which will be actually helpful for her because she will be able to use her ult. And the ult will basically give you a freeze. And if you take a look at her skills, um, sorry, her dupe. Since I have her maxed out, the damage, okay, where is it? Uh, nope, not that. Okay, yeah, there's go. No, a, a passive, sorry. Not even a deep passive. It's just a passive. Increased damage dealt to frozen targets by 20%. That is good. Wait, does it... Is it only for her? Or is it for everyone? If it's only for her, that would be decent. But if it's for everyone, that would be really good. So let's go ahead and showcase her right now. Like I said, the build for her, non-existent at the moment. I'm not rich to, do, to work on SR units that I'm not going to use. She's good, guys. But I have like other SR, uh, SSR characters I'd rather build. So there we go. So I believe this one is the one that freezes. There you go. As you can see, it freezes. It comes in clutch. Okay. And then we're going to switch over to the healer guy. And then we're going to use this. We switch over to her. I don't even know. Is there a boss in this one? There we go. We switch over to her and she froze his ass. I should have saved that actually for the boss. That freeze would have been very, very helpful. So let's see what she can do. So I believe this freezes him. There you go. And her damage to frozen target is increased. So we're going to do this. There we go. There we go. And oh, he has a break meter as well. Perfect. So yeah, it made sense that I didn't actually bring Troy, guys. Because Troy wasn't going to help with the break-in. So, you know what? That actually is very helpful, guys. Very helpful. So, we're going to break this. We're going to switch over to her. Bam! Froze his ass. Bam! Broke his ass. <laughs> she really good, guys. Now, of course, like I said, my damage is going to be absolute garbage with her right now. But that's because of the build. Just being lackluster. Freeze his ass. Freeze his ass freeze his ass no okay freeze him no stop me stop it mate oh my days okay heal do this do this next this 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 brook is okay there we go freeze his ass turn cure of course use the freeze ability when he's going to out exit out of the freeze so I think you can actually freeze him for a very long time, guys. Look at this. He's not even able to do anything. If we constantly freeze him, there you go. Look at this. Actually, wait a minute. Can I constantly freeze him every time? Nope, I can't. 
but I can freeze him for like oh, so often actually and then we can just switch out so I should actually be able to beat this guys like this is really easy now of course like my power is really high but in general that is very very useful that is actually very very useful she is a really good character she's a really really good character we're gonna go over to the next one as well she's a really really good sr unit in fact i will say she's my favorite sr unit honestly there's another sr unit that i really want to make a video on actually kim kim something he's this shield guy he's actually really good as well so we're going with this oh please do not spawn that little shite okay cool this sucks freeze his ass thank you dumbass freeze him again because he's been an idiot for spawning that death spiral he's my bum ass okay there we go okay this is pissing me off man that tornado rubbish can actually get lost bro just actually get lost okay okay if she's not good in this one it is not her fault it is just this nonsense we have right here so honestly there we go we freeze him perfect by chump okay get some heals there we go use this next there we go heals next there we go bam boy let's go use this next can we break him okay yeah well not helpful be work his ass thank you and we got the freeze and we got the freeze okay so look i hate this we're not gonna do this next but you you get a general gist of her guys that shield i'm mean, not shield sorry that freeze nutty absolutely nutty very very good character i wish we have an ssr character that can guarantee us a freeze with all of their skills really really good character guys so yeah hopefully you guys enjoyed this video if you want to know how to build her guys I do think the best thing she has is her support skill. She's a great support character, but if you're going to use her as your regular hunter for stages where you can only use the hunters, then I think if you take a look at the percentage, uh, this one's for damage, as you can see with the attack percentage being higher or the HP percentage being higher or damage percentage. Um, but this one is the freeze one generally. But yeah, I think this one is the one you want to level up the most. Basic attack as well core damage as well special as well um but overall damage from her is not going to be insane guys if you take a look at the percentage like i said not insane you just really want her for the freeze and the break ability so that's really two good things that she does it's been your boy ac gamer don't forget to like and subscribe and i'm out